Welcome to Chatterbox Audio Theater. Today's episode of Thumbnail Theater is written by Brian Wade and is called Scavenge. Listen to them. There must be millions out there. But I'm, I'm not here to listen to bugs or watch the sun go down. I'm here for my old man, who was 44 when I was born. That's like freaking prehistoric old. Wait a sec, I have a text message. Where was I? Oh yeah, yeah, my old man. Guess how old he will be when I graduate next year. 62. Which means he will be able to get the senior special at Denny's. But that's not what I want to tell you about, although it relates to his age. You see, the doctor told my old man that he needs exercise to help bring down his cholesterol. Okay, he goes on these insane walks across town through Centennial Park, which is why I'm here. Hold on, I've got to answer this. We'll be there in 15. Why do you not believe me? My friends, sometimes they can be on the demanding side. 20 minutes ago, I told them I would be at the party. Everyone who is anyone will be there into the school year kind of thing. Okay, time to find a tree. This one looks good. Like a super tall Christmas tree. Okay. Know what you're thinking. What am I doing with empties? Shouldn't these be full beers? Shouldn't I be chugging them before I get to the party? But I don't drink. Tried it once. Made me real sick. Okay. Uno, dos, tres, and roll! Right next to the trunk. Randomness is the key. Close, but not too close. I had to scavenge for these cans. Around the arena. Lucky Lager, Bud, Coors Light. Okay, I schemed up this plan a few days ago. I was in the driveway, shooting pucks at the hockey net I've got outlined in green tape on the garage door. My old man hates me doing that because the pucks leave these black scuff marks on the door. So I only do it when I know he's not around. Anyhow, I'm taking a wrister when he sneaks up on me. Danny, he says, you'll never believe what happened on my walk tonight. I pull back from taking my shot and look. He's got this mile-wide grin on and says, Danny, I made some free money tonight. I ask, how'd you do that? He pulls out three crumpled beer cans from his jacket pocket and says, I made 30 cents. Three-tenths of a dollar, and I didn't have to drive to work to do it. I didn't have to lift a finger. Yes, you did, I say. You had to pick them up. Don't be splitting hairs, Danny. Does Mom know you do this? Act like a bum scrounging cans, I ask. No, he says. And don't breathe a word to her. I haven't said anything to her. Quattro! No. No, 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 it can't be. He's already here. I have to get to that stand of trees. Okay. Made it. Oh no, I forgot my backpack. He spotted it. He's picking it up. Looking around. Hello? Is anyone here? Be cool. Don't move. My son has a pack just like this. I'm going to leave it on the bench, okay? The cans are under the tree, Dad. It's on the bench now. I don't want any trouble. I'm just out for a walk. Look under the branch, Dad. the heck? He's gone. He's really gone. He didn't take the cans. Oh, man, after all that, and he didn't take the freaking cans. Okay, already. On my way. (sighs) Guess I'll try tomorrow night. 
Find a new spot in the park, I guess. Time to get to the party. <laughs> You've been listening to Scavenge by Brian Wade, featuring Stephen Garrett and Doug Harden. Sound effects by Karen Strawn and Emily Draffin. Produced and directed by Robert Arnold. If you enjoyed that, you'll enjoy our longer shows. Hear them all for free on iTunes and chatterboxtheater.org.